Yeah, we everybody probably that thing kind of leaned on John, leaned on Patrick, Marcus, everybody leaned on our mother. But we kind of came came close to one of each other, started going places uh, as a team and stuff, and then kind of bonded. So, yeah, I think that's why it kind of clicked. So the team was kind of a team even before the season started? Yeah. Right? Eric, tell me about uh, West Virginia. It seems like they kind of slow the game down more a little bit, whereas you guys like to get up and down the court. Uh, we just gonna have to play 40 minutes of defense like we did against Cornell. Uh, they kind of like just slow the, uh, the ball down too. So if we just come out and play our game, we should have to worry about that. So how much did playing against Cornell you know, last night, how much did that, do you think it will help you in going up against West Virginia? I think it helped us a lot because don't nobody, ain't nobody going to stop on the defense again. Uh, it's Cornell, they just like to run their sets and uh, wait till the late shot clock and start trying to shoot the ball. So I think it's going to carry over a lot in this game. Now everyone's, you know, always looking for, you know, something to nitpick on. And for you guys, they might say, you know, the SEC was down a little bit this year. Playing against West Virginia, you know, from the Big East, do you guys see this, you know, possibly as a statement or anything like that? Uh, we don't think it's a statement. We just, it's, it's just a basketball game. Though. They've been saying they uh, negative stuff about us all season. Uh, but as you seen, we uh, find out where to get through it. So we just going to have to find out where to get through this. And you're one game away from the Final Four. How do you focus on just West Virginia and not look ahead to, you know, finally getting in? I uh, like to be doing the rest of this old tournament. Just focus on taking the uh, team at a time. And that's what we're doing. So we're just going to do it right there. Has this felt different, Eric, uh, being the NCAA tournament? Or does it feel like kind of the rest of the season? Yeah, it feels different because every game you got to have the mentality not to lose because uh, it's only one team going to uh, want to get a win at the end of the day. So you just got to come in with mentality just to win. Do you guys talk much about the rest of the tournament and, and some of the upsets and that kind of stuff, or not really? Uh, yeah, we, we, we kind of do, because uh, we were talking about Syracuse. And, well, Coach was talking about Syracuse, how they came out uh, playing all cool. Uh, and as in Butler came out playing like, like they, that was their last game. So that's what he, he kind of talked about us and stressed us. Has he been using that as motivation yeah, throughout he, the tournament? Yeah, he's been using using that as motivation. Don't come out with no cool attitude. Uh, come out and just just play a real aggressive. What do you expect from West Virginia? Oh, I expect a uh, great game from them because they're a great team. They wouldn't be here if they was. Uh, so we just we just got to come out and try to play harder than them. Have you talked at all about uh, things they may be doing differently now that they they lost Bryant? No, we ain't talked about it much, but I think we should get that a little bit today uh, at the break. Go ahead, break. What does it feel like to be Elite Eight, one step away from the Final Four? Oh, I feel good, uh, especially as a freshman, because we ain't never been in this type of uh, environment. And we just trying to bring and take it back to where it used to be. People from home talking to you? Oh, yeah, a lot of people from home. But Coach, he take our phones away, so we'll have to listen to all that. <laughs> yeah, no phones? <laughs> no. Nah. Like the whole tournament or how long? Yeah, he, he took him, took away him uh, pretty much the whole tournament. <laughs> what is that like? Uh, it's, it it kind of uh, took pressure off us, as you've seen. Uh, People who haven't been playing well are starting to step up big time for us. Like Darius, he's starting to step up a little bit for us and playing his game way he posted it for us. Do you feel like your thumbs are stronger now that you're not texting as much? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Uh, we starting to uh, come together. And uh, once we came together, it just pretty much clicked. Uh, I got think the phone played a big part in our, uh, in our success over these couple of games. <laughs> Eric, I think it's been on seven straight games now where you've scored in double figures. What's it been for you to continue to keep having these high scoring outputs? Uh, it's, been, it's been good because my team, I think my team needs me to, uh, to score and, and uh, do all do all the stuff that uh, it takes to win. So, yeah, if, they, if I get it open, I'm going to just start and just shoot it like I've been doing the rest of the turn. Thanks.